We live in a time when peaceable followers of Christ experience unique challenges. Those who believe in, humbly worship, and testify of Jesus Christ have always experienced trials, tribulation, and adversities. Whenever trials occur, we mourn and strive to bear one another's burdens. We lament the things that will not be accomplished and the songs that will not be sung. Bad things happen to good people on this mortal journey. Trials are a part of mortality and occur in everyone's life throughout the world. This includes major conflicts between countries and individuals. Church leaders are frequently asked, why does a just God allow bad things to happen, especially to good people? And why are those who are righteous and in the Lord's service not immune from such tragedies? We do not know all the answers. However, we do know important principles that allow us to face trials, tribulation, and adversities with faith and confidence in a bright future that awaits for each of us. It is clear we have a Father in Heaven who knows and loves us personally and understands our suffering perfectly. His His Son, Jesus Christ, is our Savior and Redeemer. In His atoning sacrifice, Jesus Christ took upon Himself our pains, afflictions, and infirmities. Because of this, He knows according to the flesh how to succor His people according to their infirmities. He invites, Come unto me, and as we do, He gives us rest, hope, strength, perspective, and healing. As we rely on Jesus Christ and His Atonement, He can help us endure our trials, sicknesses, and pain. We can be filled with joy, peace, and consolation. All that is unfair about life can be made right through the Atonement of Jesus Christ.